Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Coral and today I'm going to be doing a few things. I'm going to be opening up my monthly pin subscription box from Theme Park Monthly and I went to my post office today and found this incredible package in my mailbox just waiting for me. This is from some one of my subscribers, C. Williams. I'm not sure who that is, but you know who you are, and I thank you already. I have never seen a package so beautifully decorated in Star Wars ever. Like, I'm going to be so careful opening this up because it's so beautiful. And I'm going to be talking about another one of my subscribers as well. So stay tuned. But let's first open up our theme park monthly pin subscription box. I have opened up this pin subscription box in the past. Every month, three Disney authentic pins are sent from theme park monthly up to my home in New York State, so I get a taste of Disney pins every single month. It costs $29.99 per month, plus shipping is additional. I think it it's, ends up being around $32 a month. In my opinion, absolutely worth it. I will leave all of the information about Theme Park Monthly in the description box below if it's something you're interested in. But well, let's just jump right in. I need my scissors. Scissors. Gotta open my box with my scissors. Cooper, my golden doodle puppy, is just by my feet, so maybe at the end of this video I'll even show you how big he's getting. Alrighty, every month comes with the same color crinkly paper. It, to me, it just reminds me of Rapunzel colors. There's that pink and purple crinkle paper. And up top it says, laughter is timeless, imagination has no age, and dreams are forever, Walt Disney. Thank you, from the company. And it recommends that you take a picture of your pins, upload it to their social media sites, Facebook or Instagram, using the hashtag Theme Park Month. Oh, look at this one. Uh, this is a Fort Wilderness pin, resort and campground. This is great because Walt Disney World has specific pins for each of their resorts. I don't have a pin for Disney's Fort Wilderness Resort. So I'm kind of excited about this. It's a picture of Mickey Mouse and it says ha Happy Camper on the bottom. Let me give you a close up. So this is a silver pin and I believe silver pins in the theme parks retail for about $9.99. Pin number two. Oh, how cute. Pin number two are, they look like Vinylmation pins. It's a girl and a boy Vinylmation pin. So there's two separate pins, which is kind of fun. Let me give you a close up. So here are the little, here are the girl and boy Vinylmation pins. We have the girl with the pink bow and the boy, I'm assuming, with the black bow tie. And these are two pins, so they're two separate pins, which is really fun. And I used to collect, my kids used to collect all the vinyl mations, so it's fun to see the pins out. This is a pink pin, which in the theme parks retails for $14.99. And the last pin, oh yay, it's a 2018 pin and I don't have this pin! So I'm super excited about it! Yay! It's a Walt Disney World 2018 with Minnie Mouse. Let me give you a close up. So here's Minnie Mouse in front of all of the iconic symbols of all four theme parks. Now this is a yellow pin and in the theme parks, yellow pins retail for $12.99. So between the three of these pins, when I paid $30 or $32, I already have a value of over $30 from these three pins. So this is a reason why I love to use these subscription boxes that really cater to the clients. I love every single one of these pins. Sometimes as a travel agency owner that specializes in Disney, sometimes I, I give my subscription box items to my clients, but some of the pins I end up keeping for my pin collection. I imagine I'll be gifting all three of these pins 
to clients heading to Walt Disney World. This will be great for a client heading to Fort Wilderness Resort and this for anyone traveling in 2018. So thank you so much Theme Park Monthly. Just very happy with your services and uh, yeah, definitely go check them out. If you are a pin lover just like myself, don't live too close to the park so you can't get there to pick up pins anytime you want. This is a very big convenience for all of us who live further away. Now I have to say, I'm very curious what C. Williams put in this little package that they sent me. Again, I'm going to be very careful because this package was so carefully decorated and I really appreciate your time packaging this up and sending this to me and then just making it look extra special, so thank you. Oh boy, what's in here? Okay, first there's a piece of paper. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. I'm going to read a little bit of this because I'm not going to share the person's name. I love watching your channel and Instagram. You bring Disney magic right into my home. We are not able to go to Disney again for a while as we recently added our family times two. Times two. We had twins in 2016 and that brought us a total of six kids and eight in our family total. God bless, that's amazing. As we are now a much bigger family and our children are all on the younger end, we are waiting and saving up for our next trip. Super smart. We have been fortunate to go to Disney World many times and are itching to get back. I get it, I totally get it. So watching your channel brings it right into our homes for us. Thanks for all you do. The pin is from May the 4th Be With You Day at the Disney Store from 2015. Oh my goodness, I love it. <laughs> that is amazing. So thank you, C. Williams. Your name is going to be a mystery to everyone else, but I know it, so thank you. Wow, I cannot wait to see this pin. I always thought I would have twins. My mother is a twin, so I thought I would have twins when I became a mother myself. I didn't, but my brother, my brother had twins, so he has twin girls the same age as my youngest son, Riley. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. And I love that you even have it all packaged. I mean, it is like super, super safe and snug in this sleeve. It says, may the fourth be with you. And it has, I'll give you a close up. It has two Mickey head pin backs on the back to keep it really secure. Let me show you it up close. We have the Death Star and Darth Vader and AT-ATs and Stormtroopers. It is just beautiful. Wow. So it's from 2015. It says right there on the back. Thank you so much. I will treasure this forever. And on the back side of my Haunted Mansion pins, I have all of my Star Wars pins. So I will be adding this to this collection here. And honestly, I might start adding it to my pin board behind me. You might notice that my background is changing ever so slightly. I'm going to be doing a little overhaul behind myself. And uh, this is just kind of a temporary, I think, setup right now because there are some things missing, but I might even add this to my pin board because this is extra special. Thank you so much. I'm so glad I can bring some Disney magic to you while you can't be at the theme parks. This is definitely going to bring it to me while I, while I have it here in my home, so thank you. And last but not least, now this is where I feel horrible. Um, in the end of December of 2017, I did a film where I shared some packages that I received in my P.O. box. I had the next item I'm going to show you sitting on my desk waiting to be filmed, but I didn't turn the right direction. So I didn't end up sharing the goodies that I got from one of my subscribers. So I wanted to make the effort to thank Julia. And Julia, you know who you are. Thank you so much for sending me these items in December of 2017. They actually came in these two little boxes. So these are Hallmark Keepsake ornaments and they're both Mickey Mouse. Julia knows how much I love Sorcerer Mickey and Mickey Mouse in general, anything Disney related. So she sent me these two 
amazing Hallmark ornaments. This one is so sweet. I love him so much. He's my Sorcerer Mickey. And this is like the band concert maestro Mickey. I love him with his long red tails. Tuxedo tails. Let me show you them up close. Julia also sent me a coaster from my favorite ride in Walt Disney World, The Haunted Mansion, and here it is. I use this every single day in my office. It holds my coffee, so thank you so much. If there's a coffee stain in there, it's, it's real coffee. Trust me. <laughs> And she also sent me this really cute note. I just wanted to send you a few things to thank you for your channel and sharing the Disney joy. That just means so much to me. If you ever make it out to Disneyland, let me know. Take care and Disney on, Julia. So thank you, Julia. I feel so much better now that it's goodness. Well, now it's like an additional month after you sent me these items, but I wanted to just show my appreciation. It, really meant so much to me for you taking the time to send me this gift. Definitely not necessary, uh, but I really do appreciate it. It means a lot to me to hear that you guys appreciate all the Disney tips and tricks and unboxings that I do, but please know that I do this because I love the interactions and the friendships I make with you guys. So thank you, honestly. Thank you for making this so fun for me. Well, I think that just about does it. If you have stayed with me throughout this entire video, pat yourself on the back. Uh, I'm super proud of you because that might have taken some effort and I know it took probably a little bit more time than most of my videos usually do, but I appreciate that, thank you. And if you are new here, please consider subscribing and hit that red subscribe button below. We do a lot of fun Disney videos every week, usually one, if not more. We share a lot of laughs and we make a lot of friendships, so don't be shy. Definitely feel free to comment below, introduce yourself, and I will definitely be reaching back out to you as soon as I can. Goodness, okay guys, well, uh, the doodle keeps getting bigger. So here is my Cooper. Everyone likes to see my Cooper boy. He's a really good boy now. He's potty trained. Yeah, he's, the last time I had him in the vets was maybe two, three weeks ago and he was 35 pounds, 35 pounds, okay? He's still a lover. He loves his mom very much. And uh, let me stand up so you can kind of see how, I mean, he's just huge. He's huge, but he's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. So say bye to YouTube, Cooper. Bye, YouTube. Bye, guys. Mmm, <laughs> I love you too, buddy. I love you too. Bye.